My name is Keith Moffitt, and I'm running because I want to be your advocate on the Georgia Public Service Commission. We all know the cost of energy is going up, and I'm running because I want to give you the power. As I travel around this great state, I've met many seniors, like my Aunt Matilda, who have told me they have to choose between paying their bills and paying for their medication. Seniors have to turn out their air conditioning to keep the bill down, and we know how hot it's been these last two months. I've had met, I've met single mothers who have told me they have to choose between paying their bills and putting food on the table for their kids. We've all seen the empty houses in our neighborhoods and the foreclosures because people can't pay their bills. We've all have seen companies, big and small, go out of business in our cities and counties because of the rising costs. I know this personally because I worked in Macon City Hall, where every day people come into our office looking for help. I know this personally because I, I am the son of a single mother of three. And I remember watching her face as she had to choose how she was going to pay our bills. And by the way, I know a little something about power and energy from my Navy days on a nuclear power submarine, but we had to fix the problems right then. I joined the Navy because I couldn't afford to go to college. They said, join the Navy and see the world. But they didn't tell me that the world was 75% water. <laughs> so instead of seeing the world, I learned how to work with people of all different backgrounds. I learned how to think out of the box, how to get the job done. Things that I'm going to use as your next public service commission. Because right now we're living in a, a time where we are really living the definition of insanity. We keep doing things the same way, expecting different results. The current public service commission right now has a rate increase request in front of them. And if approved, that can result in an extra $300 a year to your power bill. Why? because we keep doing things the same way. Our main source of electricity comes from coal that we buy from out of state. We've all seen the long trains in our cities and communities that bring us into um, the state. Right now, Georgia Power is spending $1.2 billion, that's B, billion, on a scrubber unit to reduce carbon emissions that are created because we're burning coal. And who's paying for this $1.2 billion expense? We are. Why? because no one is speaking up for you and I on the commission. They're not requiring the utility companies to bring any other options to the table. Options like solar and biomass. I was at a conference uh, I was recently at a conference. I was recently at a conference where they showed me how we can make energy out of peanuts. And what does Georgia have more than anything? Georgia is blessed with 10 million acres of agricultural land. With a serious energy policy plan that includes biomass and solar, Georgia can be the leading energy, um, Georgia can be the leading energy um, leader in the nation in the coming years. Yeah. But what stands in our way of, of, of us doing that? My opponent says that he's a strong believer in the free market and less government. I have an MBA and I have a pretty good understanding of the free market and business models. But the free market has led us right now to higher energy bills while the utility companies protect their profit margins. As the role of, as, and the role of the PSC is to interfere, is to protect the consumer. It's their job to be your advocate. If we let utility companies regulate themselves, then we will continue to see rate increase after rate increase. So what do I need? I need your vote. The other side is well funded and the numbers show that we have an uphill battle. But with hard work, we can win. I need you to vote for a purpose for Keith Moffitt. I need you to vote all the way down the ballot. I need, when you vote for Senator Thurman, Governor Barnes, Lieutenant Governor Porter, I need you to look for Keith Moffitt on that ballot. <laughs> I need your help also raise your money so we can do mail, signs, buttons, anything we can do to get the message out. But most of all, for people that don't know me, but know you, I need you to tell them that I'm on your side. Tell them that when they open a utility bill, that I'm the guy who's working for you. I'm Keith Moffitt, and I appreciate your vote, and I humbly and greatly accept the nomination for the service.